Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I thought I would tape my breakfast brunch, which I got delivery from Campos Tacos in West Los Angeles. There's two locations. There's one on Robertson, there's one on Venice. I usually just order from the Robertson one. I feel like it's slightly closer. So I already untied the bag. And then I was like, oh, I should tape it. But before we get into that, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And let me know if there is a specific cuisine that you would like me to try. Okay, so I'm going to have a sip of water. Okay, so let's get started. I untied the bag, but I didn't open it yet. And Campos is a Mexican restaurant actually it's i think it's very casual i've never eaten there i've only gotten delivery it's very mom and pop so it's kind of on the chipotle level but chipotle looks really cool so i feel like if you've been to like a bowling alley in america and it's that very 80s style furniture that's what I'm talking about more along the lines of. Okay, so here's one item that I got. So I ordered a breakfast burrito with ham, cheese, and scrambled egg inside, and then it comes with chips and salsa, but the salsa, while it's not that spicy, every time I eat it, my stomach, I get sick, but it's so good. So now I've asked them to give me pico de gallo. So they gave me two bags of chips because I also got a side of taquitos. Here's the silverware. Here's the pico de gallo. Here's my breakfast burrito. And then I'll show you the taquitos, but I probably won't eat them right now. And it's good because the taquitos already come with guacamole. So let's definitely get the breakfast burrito out and I've watched YouTube videos where the reason why breakfast burritos that you get at restaurants taste way better is because when they wrap it in the foil and everything it kind of steams the tortilla from the hot ingredients inside and then also the foil so that's why it doesn't taste the same also maybe like the grill or what kind of grease and lard that they use so here's the breakfast burrito. It looks delicious. I love flour tortillas. It's very warm. Okay. And then let's start from this end. There's no foil in here. Usually I feel like there is, but let me go ahead and take a few bites so you can see inside. I'm debating if I should warm this up. I feel like I will. I'm gonna warm this up, I'll be right back. Hi guys, so I'm back. I warmed up my burrito for about 30 to 40 seconds. It's much hotter now because the cheese has melted on the inside. I'm gonna try to grab that cheese with a chip. I love their chips, they're very thin. They put a little salt on it. So. A 
Look at that. Yum. My hair is sticking up. It's starting to get cold in LA, which is why I'm wearing my robe. Very good. Okay, I'm just trying to get the cheese into the burrito. So here we go. I don't think you could really see the ham. Sometimes they put it in like a big old slab, sometimes they chop it up. Okay, so let's try some of the pico de gallo. Oh no, I'm spilling it. Great. Hold on. If you've never had pico de gallo, it is finely chopped tomatoes, cilantro, and red onion. And that's it. And I remember reading how salsa is the number one condiment. I think because it's so healthy. That was a while ago when I read it. I want to say like several years, so I don't know if it's still true, but I would not be surprised if it was. So here's some of that. Let's put it on top. Like that. Okay, let's have a bite. Oh no. Yeah, this time they only put a couple of pieces of ham. I feel like there's not enough ham at all. Okay. My stomach is growling as I'm eating. That's how hungry I am. Okay. Did I spill? I don't know what that was. It looks like a piece of plastic. I don't know where it came from. Not my food though. Okay. Oh no, I dropped a tomato piece. Okay.
Oh wow, now there's all this ham concentrated in the middle. I'm pretty sure I will tape a taquitos video so that you guys could see that as well. I dropped some cilantro on the table. Okay. Okay, everyone, I'm going to finish the other half of the burrito off camera. I just wanted to show you my meal. If you like Mexican food and you're in L.A. and you want a fairly inexpensive meal, I think this burrito was about 6 bucks. The taquitos were about five fifty. which, you know, Chipotle could be like anywhere from 8 to $10.00. I know if you go to like Del Taco or Taco Bell, it's much cheaper, but it's considered fast food. So this is more of a home cooked, home style burrito for very good cost. Okay, all right. So I hope you have a great day. I hope to see you in the next video. I hope you like this one and thanks so much for watching.